is a demonstration of advanced energy MDX1K DC magnetron sputtering power supply and magnetron cathode. This DC magnetron cathode has a two inch diameter target. It has a power output of 1000 watts and is powered by 120 volts AC. In the rear, very importantly, is the uh, is the jumper. Uh, this interlock allows the unit to be operated from the front panel controls. This would normally be going to your uh, remote computer for control. So that needs to be in place. This is our main power. When it turns on, the fan will come on. Uh, even though the unit has not been turned on in the front yet. Now we turn on the power button. Regulation can be power in watts or current in amps or voltage in voltage. Uh, this is a ramp adjust that allows you to ramp up to the level that you've, uh, that you've set. On this side, we have our set point. will actually allow you to um, set the wattage that you want. And we can also display the actual values as well on this side, both in volts, current in amps, and wattage. So now what we'll do is um, we're using our test resistors here. We have uh, approximately a thousand ohms um, all hooked up in series. Uh, they will get warm, but they're more than adequate to handle the power of this piece of equipment. So here we go. What I'm going to do is I'm going to start off at... Um, zero, turn it on this way, and we'll look at our set point for now. Wait a minute, let me get it right back to where I want it. Okay, and here we go. First, we're going to go up to 100 watts. Okay, which is about 334 volts. Uh, our meter shows that we're 339, that's very good. Uh, we're still very cool. Uh, believe it or not, the temperature will be identical on every single one of these if you were to measure them. And here we go. We'll go back to our wattage. We'll go 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, and our ma we max out here at. Um, Hold on a second. At 925 watts, at 991 volts, should give us about one amp. And that's exactly where we are. Point nine one three. As you can see, very carefully, we've already gone up seven degrees. Turn it off and bounce it back on. There we go. Very simple to use, 
um, nice and compact. Fits well into a rack with another unit. This is half of a 19 inch rack. And this completes this demonstration.